YouTubers love making music. YouTubers love making music videos. I am a YouTuber and I love making things. So today I wanted to challenge myself to see if I could make my very own music video. And in just 48 hours. But why this seemingly arbitrary amount of time, Kieran? Well, let me tell you, the very wise Mark Hass Brownlee once said, for skill development, spending 10 hours on 10 videos is greater than spending 100 hours on one video. I want to put that hypothesis to the test. Now you've probably seen this video pop up because you've got notifications on because you're a top G and you've cringed at the thought of this guy, yes, this guy making a song. Women, women in general, I love women, specifically women, ones in general, women. But the most successful fellow used to be Pink Guy, so, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't roll this guy out yet. Cheers. <laughs> a little taster. Come on. Come on. Women, oh women in general, I bloody love women, just the ones in general. I like the big ones, skinny ones, tall ones, wide ones, ones that have one leg, no legs, two legs, six and four, legs eight, legs she plays, centre back for a Sunday league team. Now, if you couldn't tell, I've sort of figured out how to use autotune. So maybe we could do a rap video. So I've written some bars down, some absolute fire lines, which I'm pretty sure are going to amount to a summer anthem, an absolute corker. All the local rap scallions are going to be playing this outside of their local Londis, out of the speaker on the phone, maybe, if it's good enough, out loud on the back of a bus. F off some sort of family. Alexa, play guest list by Kieran Carlin. There's a party in my pants and you're on the guest list. Two for one cock, you're on the guest list. Free entry to my pants cause you're on the guest list. I'll take a mimosa, can you afford this? I'm in my overdraft so you're paying for this. I like your pretty hair, it's straight and black. Apart from the couple growing out your back. I'm not into that, I'm not a fan of that. Get a back and crack or you won't get the sack. That's uh... That's all I've got so far. Now, as great as my bars are and my singing ability, I'd much rather use a professional track made by a professional that people have actually heard of. So let's jump onto today's sponsors, Lit, and have a gander at the library of popular music and see what songs we can make a music video for. Ooh, they've got the Craze song. This could work. Okay, okay, I can picture this. A bit of Charlie Puth, bit of Oliver Tree. We got Sean Paul. You can't go wrong with Sean Paul. Five million and forty, naughty, shorty. Baby girl, I'm a guest, I'm a guest. Sandra Paul said, Well, I'm on the way the time. Paul, I wanna be keeping you warm. I got the right. You know, I have no idea what Sean Paul is saying half the time, but I love it. That song could work, but I did a little bit of Sean Paul in the previous video. So what about... Ooh, pretty fly for a white guy. Gig, oh, this is an absolute anthem. This song was actually written about me. For a white guy. Alright, I'll right, tell you what, do they have yeah, red light, green light. This song has instructions, which is always good in a song and very helpful if you're making your first ever music video. Okay, nice little two-stepper, little two-stepper. Um, can you turn that beat up a little bit? <laughs> oh, yeah, oh. Just like that. Perfect. There's two instructions. Oh, I could do, I could be doing the instructions. I need you to follow. Like in a massive club like print works, I'm a big hologram head. When I say red light. The vision's coming to me now. I need you to stop. When I say green light, I need you to go. Red light. 
green light. This is gonna be sick and hopefully really weird. As a creator, I'd highly recommend using Licked. Videos are so much better and more engaging if you use a song that people actually know. You don't have to worry about copyright claims or strikes or losing monetization or any of that. They've also just introduced a subscription-based stock music library, making them the place to go for all your licensed music needs. Licked have all your chart and stock music requirements covered so you can improve your video quality. Get 50% off your first chart track and 60 days free stock music using my link in the description. Now a two minute video of me rotoscoped out would be a bit of a cop out in my opinion because I do that all the time and I love learning new 3D skills so to test this hypothesis today I'm going to make this entire music video in the free 3D program Blender. Now earlier I mentioned the concept being in a club like Printworks with a massive hologram head shouting the lyrics to the dancers. I then wanted to get progressively crazier, a bit in the style of late for meeting. Until everyone breaks out the club and starts dancing in the streets and other places like the pyramids. So I covered myself in green and this is how I recorded the hologram head segment. <laughs> Slap on the hologram preset and oh yes. Perfect. A previs is what they do in films to see if the shots will work. It's like a basic 3D animation before they spend the insane amount of time making it look all shiny and nice only for people like me to give it a half star rating and call everyone who watches the crap a waste of space and sit upon my golden film degree phone because my subjective opinion is actually objective. This is my previs. After just six seconds and two shots, I looked at the clock and I realized I simply did not have the time to previs my whole video and I'm just gonna have to go hard in the paint and get animating. Surprisingly, my similarities to Andy Circus don't just exist in the physical reality, it's also in the interest of motion capture. Skywalker. <laughs> now I did want to spend four grand on this full motion capture suit from Rococo, but my head said not quite yet. Instead, my frugal ways pointed me to a website called Plask.ai and artificial intelligence is amazing at the moment. You just upload a video of yourself doing whatever you want to do and it somehow figures it out and gives you a motion capture rig. It's cool, it's janky and it's free. Now all I need to do next is do a couple more dances. <laughs> Sprinkle it into Blender and populate the dance floor. <laughs> this is going well. I am learning. A little bit worried about the time though. Uh, I just come to uh, jump in and say that I'm f mate. Honestly, I'm f I've done. I just done like half the shots, and I've got I've got half the time left. But you're like, well, I guess I guess you could cut it close, but you you'll, you'll, you'll do it. The, the math adds up there. But does it? I don't think it does. I have a very ambitious second half to the video and I'm worried, I'm severely worried. I wanted to put Shrek in the video and I couldn't because his textures wouldn't load and I don't have time. Imagine if Shrek was in it. Imagine the <laughs> oh memes. Why do they have the Shrek thing still near the London Eye? That's weird, isn't it? When, when was the last time a Shrek film came out? Anyway, back to me being f I'm not medically an idiot. But I think I might have been a wee bit too ambitious for this one. Turns out, 3D stuff takes fucking ages. This is it. And just like on Mario Kart, I've had to cut some serious corners. I've generally learned so much on the way. And you know what? I think the Marcus Brownlee tweet is correct. I have learned so much in such a short period of time, which I feel like will fare me better than if I had spent like an entire month on this video. I've gone from basic modeling and texturing to understanding lights and how to do bloody motion capture better. So before we watch the wonderful musical masterpiece that I've created, I just wanna say, why don't you set yourself a target of learning something new? Give yourself a couple days and that's it. You have to finish it by the end of those days, no matter what. You will learn a lot more than if you go, ah, oh, well, I'll, I'll give myself two months on this. Finish it. There's nothing better than just getting it finished. Duke, um, can you turn that beat up a little bit? Yeah, just like that. Perfect. There's two instructions. I need you to follow. 
When I say red light, I need you to stop. When I say green light, I need you to go. Red light. Green light. Now when the strobe light hits, I want you to move like this. Now when the strobe light hits, I want you to move like this. Hit the strobe. 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 P. Larry or Leroy. Barbara, get it. We'll get no stress on. Next bus leaves in two days, so this is it. Now, 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 now. We know we've all been through kindergarten, people. So we know what a red light and a green light is. So when I say red light, stop. Red light. Wow. That was weird. Clearly, I ran out of time halfway through. <laughs> but it is what it is. If you've enjoyed this video, why don't you have a go yourself? Set yourself a time limit. Grab yourself a track from Licked using my link in the description. Upload it to YouTube and send it to me, and I'll give you some feedback. I've been your boy, Kieran, and I'll see you in the next one.